What is up, with you guys? Like doing welcome to Matano. It's your boy, and I'm back again. Happy week, guys. Happy Monday. Hopefully, you guys are doing well. You're healthy, and you are loving life. If you're not, guys, then make sure you subscribe to my channel because I will keep you happy as well. So we have got the Supreme, guys. Every Monday during the Supreme season, we do Supreme drops. So this week we've got Supreme and Not Face. I don't know why I'm sounding so excited because the collection does not meet my expectations. Just because it's just one of those subpar, below average type of items. So I'll show you guys in a couple of seconds. And bam, as you guys can see, shout out to Supreme Link News. You've got the Supreme and North Face jacket there, which looked rather a little bit weird. I don't know why they didn't keep the color of, you know, the red as consistent and just simple. They've went and done that like weird tie dye effect, which looks horrible. I think um, I was really expecting quite a lot from Trimmery, the new creative director. But looking at this, I don't know. I think it's going to be a long spring summer, ladies and gentlemen. I can guarantee you that. So far, we've not seen anything new. There was a lot of hype because of what he done with Levi jeans, you know. But so far, he's not delivered at all, and it's a little bit disappointing. I don't care what colors comes in. It looks horrible. It looks as if it's kind of like um, that like patent leather, which is crinkled. That's just the design I'm getting from that. So I'll look at the different colors of that as well, guys. Then you've also got the t-shirts as well, which just look just cheap. They don't look boxy as such. They just look horrible with a little side pocket as well on your left side of your chest. Yeah, it's just not happening. Then you've got the puffer jacket, which looks trash. It looks horrible, especially in that color as well. I'd rather get the North Face. I used to have a North Face jacket, which came in this black and yellow combination. I'd prefer that over this. It's cheaper. What's the point of spending almost 400 pounds on a puffer jacket? If you're going to get that, this I do like a little bit more. I think I prefer this. This has got the matching pants as well. I like the, the pattern. I like how busy it is. And then also how you've got the kind of uh, black borderline, which kind of, you know, uh, presents this like illusion of like a second top, you know, with no sleeves on there. I like that with the matching pants as well. So it's got some matching shorts, better yet. Then you've got these match, well, not even matching pants. Then you've got these khaki green pants or olive green, whatever you want to call it. These are nice. I like them, especially in this color as well. I've got some cargo some, uh, some uh, I can't even get my train of thought correctly because Supreme is doing this. So I've got this Travis Scott olive green shoes, I was going to say, which would definitely go well with this as well. Then you've got the hoodie as well, which is just meh. It looks cheap as well when I'm looking at it online. And I know it's going to be cheap as well. So yeah, it's not looking good. So you've got the matching bottoms to the matching, to the tops. Guys, I beg your pardon. I'm just like, yeah, disappointed. So you got these, like, which are meant to match the other jacket, which I showed you initially. These are trash as well. I mean, this color, when I say trash, I don't mean like, I don't mean like the horrible, like horrible, oh my God. But I'm comparing to the Supreme and North Face collaborations from before. So I'm using that to compare it to this current drop that's due to come out. So hence why I'm saying this is trash. To other people, I'm aware that you guys might like it, and I get it, but I'm kind of, you know, comparing it to that. I don't know. It's just, I think, a fair system to use. Then you've got these shorts here, which I do love. I think these are nice. Even just buying these alone and maybe, like, wearing, like, a kind of a... Could be, like, an OT or, like, a WT kind of top. You know, it does go well. It looks warm. It looks, you know, fluffy. I like it. I like the material, to be honest. Yeah... Yeah, let's not talk about this. This, I'm not really sure how I feel about it. It's kind of giving me like, you know, beanie slash bucket, you know, vibes about it. I'm not really feeling it, to be honest. So we'll just go and drop double G, guys, and we'll see some more. So that's the other different color. Even in this color as well, you just can't really justify it. That's the different t-shirt or different color t-shirt. I don't know. Different colored puffer jacket yeah so that's the fluffy thing so when you look at him with the matching hat it's just a little bit too much but i think just the top on its own is okay you can get away with wearing that then you have got the 
tracksuit bottom there. So initially when they showed the tracksuit bottom in that olive green, I thought it was gonna be like nice and baggy, but it seems to hang a little bit and I don't like the way it hangs. Usually it means the material is rather quite cheap as well. So yeah, I'd just stay away from that. Even in black as well, the puffer jacket just doesn't deliver. I'm sorry, but it just doesn't work. That's the top there, which comes in purple. I mean, now look at the pants in comparison. The pants are nice, they're baggy. They're kind of like basketball training shorts. You know, the long ones. I like that about it. So guys, we're just going to conclude here, I think. Let me just double check on drops double G. Because they've always got some top-notch information. Yeah, they just kind of gave that information which is still basic as well what do you guys think comment down below what's your preferred item i think a lot of people are going to hold up from buying this week because it's just yeah supper thanks for watching guys god bless and i'll see you guys soon peace out